He was known by one name and for one thing, being one of the greatest soccer players the world has ever known. Pele was born in Brazil in 1940. As a boy growing up in poverty, he developed his talent by kicking around a rolled up sock stuffed with rags. By the age of 15, coaches persuaded his parents to let him leave home to join a professional team. The world got to know the Brazilian phenom during the 1958 World Cup in Sweden. Just 17 years old, Pele scored three goals in a semifinal win over France, and he scored two more in the finals to lead Brazil to a World Cup win over Sweden. Thus, a legend was born. During the 1960s, Pele was one of the most famous and highest paid athletes in the world. It's often reported that the two factions in the Nigerian Civil War agreed to a 48-hour ceasefire so they could watch Pele play an exhibition match in Lagos. In 1970, Pele led Brazil to a third World Cup victory, this time scoring four goals. He retired in 1974, but was lured to America to play for the New York Cosmos. His very presence in the U.S. helped give the sport a huge boost. He retired for good in 1977. He scored 1,281 goals and was named FIFA's co-player of the century. During the next 30 years, Pele was a popular ambassador for the sport, especially as his home country hosted the 2014 World Cup. Football always was the best promoter of Brazil, no? always put Brazil in the top. The man, born Edson Arantes do Nascimento, died as a globally famous icon of one of the world's most popular sports. Maggie Rulli, ABC News.